Hey guys! So, today... <clears throat> today's video is a what's in my pool bag video. And I purposely left those open to try and contrast all the white that is happening right now. But I don't think it's working too well, so let's just leave it at that. Why don't we just get started into what is in my pool bag. So, starting generally, this is all just basic necessities that we all have and they are my phone, um, pair of sunglasses, this has been in my videos before, this is from Target, and my keys, which just have a little, um, what's it called, the creaseless hair ties on them. Next, I have my goggles. I don't actually wear goggles that much. Next, I have some sunscreen and this is from Rite Aid. I just got the highest amount of SPF for the lowest price and that was this one. This one is the Rite Aid brand Continuous Spray Sunscreen with Broad Spectrum SPF 70. Next, I have a little drink. This is orange juice from Tropicana and I just like to have a light snack with me. Next, I have a hair tie and a hair clip just in case I want to get my hair up and out of my face. Next, I have some band-aids in this Paul Frank, um, I don't know what to call this really, but it's a band-aid case basically. So the band-aids look like this. Next thing I have is a face sunscreen and I like to differentiate both of them, except I don't use this as much often because this is my mom's and this only has SPF 30. Next, moving on to this little compartment that I keep inside the bag. So in this compartment, we have lots of things. We have my earphones, first of all, as another necessity. I have some lotion, just in case my skin gets dry, which is bound to happen because of the sun. This is Endless Weekend from Bath & Body Works. I have some perfume. Um, I don't really know why this is in here gives up the summery vibe even though you're gonna be in the water but hey next I have some deodorant just in case I forgot I mean you're supposed to wear deodorant anyway during summer but yeah next I have some hand sanitizer just because you know you never know who's been doing what and touching where and I'm slightly not I'm not too germophobic, and I don't really like the smell of this. Next, I have some oil absorbing sheets. Um, not because you're gonna go in the water, just cause, you know, if you're gonna be out in the sun, um, either you're in the water or not, getting your face wet or not, um, I'm bound to get a little bit oily in the T-zone. I have some moisture mist for you know, again, if I'm dry, I do get dry in some areas of my face, even when I'm oily. So, something like this is very essential. The next thing I have is this Tresemme Perfectly Undone Sea Salt Spray with sea kelp extract. It's basically the spray version of the foam thing. And basically, it just gives your hair a lot of texture and volume if you want to spray it into the roots. But basically, it makes you look like you have the beautiful, like, beach after beach hair kind of thing. And you didn't actually have to go to the beach. So, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you liked it, then give it a thumbs up. Comment down below and subscribe for more videos. Again, I do apologize for my voice, first of all. So, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!